Hey, what's up everybody? I'm going to show you how to do a factory reset on any Dell laptop. In my case, I'm using an XPS 13, but this should work with any Dell laptop or possibly any laptop with Windows 10. So you just go down here to your search bar and type in reset. And you're going to see this reset this PC right here. If you don't have your search bar set up like this, you can just simply type on the start menu and type in reset. It'll take you to the same place and just click on reset this PC. And then it's going to come up here and then it's going to say, at the top it's going to say reset this PC. You're just going to want to click on that, get started. And then you have two options. The first one is keep my files, which will basically remove everything except for your personal files. So those will still be on there. But if you're like selling or getting rid of this laptop somehow, you're going to want to remove everything. This is like a full restore. It will take all your files off and anything that you put on here. So that's what I'm going to be doing because I'm sending this laptop back. And then you can do a cloud download, which downloads and reinstalls Windows. Or a local install, which will reinstall Windows from this device. Usually when the computer is originally set up, it will have a uh, separate partition with Windows on it. So this, this should be a lot faster. So I'm going to do the local reinstall. <coughs> and then each one of these steps it will tell you what it's doing. This one's going to remove apps and files. Do not clean the drive. Which means it won't. It's not like a hard restore where it's going to put all zeros in the hard drive. It's just going to be a regular erase. And then it's going to reinstall Windows from this device. And hit next. I suggest you have your laptop plugged in because this uh, might take a while and you do not want your laptop to die in the middle of this. And it tells you what it's going to do. It will remove all the personal files, remove any changes made to settings, remove all apps and programs, reinstall Windows from this device. This will take a while and your PC will restart. That's why you want to have it plugged in and then you just hit reset and that'll be it. Appreciate you checking out the video. Leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.